so hi together I extended my installation with an extra poor sinus wave inverter with the power of uh, 1500 watts and 300, uh, 3000 watts peak I inserted this uh, 300 amps fuse I know it's a little bit over I need to think 240 to get the 300 watts but I did not go this these are resettable fuses and my plan is to supply an uh, 800 watt uh, water pump in the garden which is already there as an alternative to the 12 volt setup for if we need uh, more water quickly so this is beside the it's in parallel to the inverter getting this 16 square millimeter power cords directly with the minus to the black and uh, the plus to the inside of the fuse and go down to the load or the inverter so now it's everything off I just started so I did not test it before but There we're seeing it running. So I think this uh, 2.127 amps is going directly to the uh, directly to the inverter and not inside the battery. I hope so. But uh, we could also. See it. Let's remove the. Let's get some focus. So you see, it's two hundred nineteen volts, fifty hertz. The inside temperature is six Celsius, but maybe not degrees but more Fahrenheit or something is broken so if I just start it let's see how much uh, current we draw nothing quite interesting you do not use power So if I start it, I see 202 20 milliamps, but no, so we need something, let's say, bigger, which consumes more because this is also an 800 watts, a 700 watts device. So let's see if we can get uh, another more power consumption device, which I can easily turn on and off. I'd also like to test it with this because it's a motor but it's also a brushed motor so you may hear it I just turned on the printer ABS 105 degrees. Now there should be some. So, yeah, there you see it. It's now it's pulling. Uh, but it's only 40 watts. So, but do you see the voltage of the battery? Did, did uh, drop rapidly? So I think you're not able to read the current consumption, it's useless. I don't have a power meter to measure the output power.
and you also do not hear the fan turning on but yeah this is the run with the AC output for my 3D printer so in theory you are able to print off the grid thank you for watching bye like and subscribe